This is Dianita and welcome back to Barbados Matters where we check out the sites and discuss the issues. For those of you who've watched any of my previous videos know that I like to show you a place in Barbados first because of my love of this beautiful island and then I go on to discuss various topics. But I thought it would be good to just do a snapshot video where you can just check out the sites. So in this video, I'm taking you to the north of the island where I make a stop firstly by Cherry Tree Hill, which borders St. Peter and St. Andrew. Look at this site. I'm currently at least 850 meters above sea level. Whilst I'll take you there another time, St. Nicholas Abbey with all its beauty is close by, as well as the St. Nicholas Heritage Railway, which is the steam engine that takes a 45 minute historic tour and gives you another wonderful opportunity to take in the sights from the area. But look here, I just love visiting Cherry Tree Hill for this wonderful site, and there are some lovely craft vendors here selling their own creations of jewelry, ornaments, leather craft, and more. Just look at this awesome view. I'm looking over the eastern part of the island, as well as what is known as the Scotland District. And in the distance, you can see the Morgan Lewis Sugar Windmill. Here's a closer look at the windmill. It's straight down the road from Cherry Tree and located in St Andrew, still north of the island. The Morgan Lewis windmill was previously used in the 18th and 19th century to grind the sugar cane to make sugar. It was still intact until it sustained damage by Hurricane Elsa on the 2nd of July 2021. Here you can see the damaged wing. Such a shame, but I've been reliably informed that it should be fixed in due course. So I hope so sooner rather than later. And I can't be in this area without driving straight onto the Magnetic or Gravity Hill, still known as Cherry Tree Hill or Morgan Lewis Hill. I'm sure a lot of people, tourists as well as locals, don't even know this wonder of the world even exists. It's this spot here just away down from the Morgan Lewis windmill and it's not signposted so you only really know by word of mouth or if a tour guide or someone tells you about it. So I'm not sure if you can see here but the car is in neutral and the engine is switched off. Watch the car reverse up the hill all on its own. <laughs> My friend almost let the car go into the bush but look again. And you can see it here from the outside. When researching this phenomenon, it was said that it's some kind of optical illusion, but you can clearly see the car rolling back up the hill with the engine off. And it certainly was no illusion that the car nearly ended up in the bush because she wasn't steering the car properly. Anyway, whatever the explanation, it's definitely a place to visit and check it out for yourself. I understand that there are only a few of these magnetic or gravity hills around the world, and I'm proud to say that we have one in Barbados. So I hope you enjoyed this video from Cherry Tree Hill in the north of the island. And don't forget to watch some of my other videos where I check out the sites and discuss the issues. Don't forget to like, subscribe and share.